Hello friends and family, here we are in the dungeon, but you can't see, I'm just in the map. I haven't even checked to see if the audio, yeah, it's working okay. We're pretty good, in the hood. This first start of the dungeon, you see there's nothing really, no spots unlocked. Oh, maybe I do need that. A ghost. Well, <laughs> wow. Now we know how to deal with that now. Ghosts don't play around. My health slowly regenerating. I'm not sure why, but I'll take it. I wonder about that. Locked out right away. Scarlet, they killed him. here you are. I was looking for you. It was a horrible night. Knox, what are you... What happened to your eyes? They said they wanted to meet us to discuss a peace treaty. Who did this to you? Because the message came from one of our own people. Leora. All of us went there, right into the trap. It was the night of the blade. Okay, they smashed the resistance. It was later that night when they found a way to become undead. Immortals. Untouchable by death. That was seven moons ago. Now, it's always dark. Who did this to you? It doesn't matter. I didn't betray you. For once in my life, I did the right thing. I did it for you. So go, Scarlet, go and do what you have to do for me. I don't want. I still know so little. 
All you need to know is that if Victor finds the Black Grimoire, he can speak the final spell and everything we know will come to an end. You can't let him get the book. You've got to find Victor. And when you do, run that Moonblade right through his undead heart, no matter what the cost. We all need to pay. Is there still hope at all? Or is it too late already? As Leora says, maybe soon we'll find out. I will go now. You know what you need to do. And use your powers. Th there is someone around who can help you. Okay then. It's very courageous of you to come down here, whoever you may be. I spoke to Leora. My wife? Oh, my beautiful wife. She's overcome with guilt for all that she did. She did it all with good at heart. She wanted the best for all of us. Does she seek my forgiveness? Oh, Leora. I will never forget the first Mayflower she gave me. I do not need to forgive her. For I always knew she wanted to do the right thing. I will love her forever. In her world and the next. Please, tell her I said that. Okay. That's kind of what I want to find out anyways. <laughs> I missed part of that. Do it again anyways. Cracking locks and getting experience. The skulls you gotta use the watch calls on too. That just seems like it might be a little bit big. What we can do in it. That might be a, a mission too, is to 
tell those ghosts that that one guy wanted. area. Get over there. Shit. if there's some way to fall in the water once you go down I'll show you guys I hear those little holes I wonder if you can fall into one of them and, and walk up somewhere else um, that's for two we, we should also be looking for a uh, Should also be over here as well. Unless there's, unless there's more than one. Maybe there's more than one. Uh, what are they called? More than one of these uh, places. How do 
see it to this last bit. Seriously. And over here, there's no ladder. Down here. I'm determined to freaking figure out where the, where the hell to go. Get to that last ghost, monster, creature, guy, place. I give up. Screw it. I don't even care if there's anything to do with it. I just want to get out of here now. It's annoying me. Okay, that. Wait, why can't I climb on this thing though? Okay then. You can't climb on it? That's kind of strange, but I guess it makes sense. Well. We can get a meeting with the old boy, so. I guess that's a good thing. It's daytime now. I guess it just takes a while to register. Register. Alrighty then. I should go in there and check out what he has. Where the one guy is, okay, never mind.
Hello. Goodbye. So, we meet again. How pleasant to see that you survived your encounter with the Dervish Mistress. Although, when she was dead, my trading with the Assassin Order ended. Because the Order had ended. But don't worry, I'm not angry with you. You surely did what you had to. Show me your goods. Really? Why does it say it's over here? Wow, the crypt was... Okay then. So there's more than one crypt, I guess. <laughs> that was very slow. Meaningless, but okay. I almost feel like I should take this stuff back so I can sell all my items. So I could go up there and, uh. When I turn in the first couple of missions, I can turn to nighttime and then walk all the way down there and do the boat one as well. Not just talk to that one guy.
I hope things are going well with your assignment. Here's the helmet. Once more, you have convinced me of your courage. Legends say that the helmet fell when Grom struck Antony with a club, but St. Antony did not stumble. Grom wanted to kill St. Antony because Antony showed no mercy, and this was our rule for a very long time. Never let a downed enemy live. Take no prisoners. But we changed this rule. And nowadays, we are forgiving to those pitiful enough to be defeated in combat. We will place this sacred item on his sarcophagus. Here, take this as your reward. When you want another challenge, let me know. Welcome home. Are there any jobs I can do for the Order? There is something else we hoped you could do. Your help has been invaluable so far. But there's still one item missing from St. Antony's armor. The harness. We've discovered it's in a country far away, in an eternally dark place. Take this key and find this cursed tomb. Good luck with this last assignment. So if it's far away, that's all you tell me. I hope yeah. things are... I want to learn... Amongst... How far I can go? Hmm, that looks How good. How can I help you? I'd like to see. Wait for nice. Nice, I didn't know I got that life ring. I had to figure though because it was uh, the way it was worded. Yeah, the way it was worded, but that was getting health. Had to be something. What the hell? Hey, adventurer! Wouldn't you like to find some treasure? What are you selling? 
go. I think there's all this to find all the treasure spots. We'll make it. It's all the stuff so we could get, uh, we found all the, all the treasures. Just to buy a bunch of treasure maps that I'll probably never use. I got a shovel though, so. If I get him in my fingers ever again, I'll kill him. Who are you talking about? He ripped me off this loud mouth, talking all about his great ship and how strong he is. Well, I must admit he was kind of strong, but he left without paying me. Kitten took the money he owed me from my wage. 150 ducats, gone. Here's your money. You're a noble person. Wish there were more of your kind around. Hello, sweetheart. Can't you see that I'm busy? Leave me alone! Guard your tongue. Hey, no need to be upset. No offence meant. Can't you see that I'm busy? Guard your time. Hello, sweetheart. Hello, sweetheart. Okay. Um. Yeah. 
Indeed. More experience. Oh, that would have went right there too, wouldn't it? Been? Sorry, we've got no jobs at the moment. The girls can handle them all. Oh, sorry. Goodbye. Sorry. Oh. Time of day, there's always bad guys around here, huh? Oh, hello. Leave me alone. I spoke to your husband. What? How? Oh, no. That looks good. I don't believe you. He said he will never forget the first Mayflower you gave him. Oh. How? So you... you speak the truth. And he said that he doesn't need to forgive you, for he always knew you wanted to do the right thing. Oh, it's true. I made a very bad mistake. It was a moonless night. I knew we'd missed all the chances we were going to get to dispossess the Doge. The resistance was already scarce, and then I met Victor. I didn't want them to die. And he offered me their lives if I delivered them to him. So... I betrayed them to save them. What choice did I have? If we kept fighting, we were all going to die. Better alive in prison waiting for another opportunity than being slain by the Doge's guards. But just as I had betrayed my friends, Victor had betrayed me. He didn't take a single prisoner. They all died that night. Everything I'd worked for, everything I'd lived for, and everyone I'd loved. Gone. After that, there was no point in fighting anymore. Instead, I consigned myself to a life at Victor's side. I decided that this was to be my punishment until the end of my days. It's never too late. I will change things. 
No, you won't. Don't you understand? You'll just go down the same road I did. In the end, instead of helping, you'll just make things even worse. You cannot change fate. Nobody can. The sooner you accept this, the less damage you'll cause. Now leave me alone. I shall return to my master soon. Here. This is a letter of recommendation. Now you can go and see Largo, who can tell you anything about this district that you need to know. Indeed. Oh, that looks good. I can talk to this fool and see what's up. See what is to be up. Should have made it night time too. As I think about it. Wait. Do you have an invitation? Yes. Here it is. Thank you. You may part. What can I do for you? I knew you'd show up here sooner or later. I wonder who might have given you the permit. You're a soldier of fortune, coming to a place of opportunities. But before you step any further, there's something you need to know. This district is my district. It may look run down, it might be corrupt, and hell, Lord knows there are killings on the streets. Opiates, firecap mushrooms, or worse. But it works. It works because the people obey my rules. The dockyard produces ships for the doge. A gigantic fleet of vessels. And as long as I give the ships to the doge, anything else I do is tolerated. So as long as the people obey my rules, everybody has a good day in the streets of the Arsenal district. So, how about you? Will you obey my rules? or not. bad I gotta do it opiates and dead bodies your rules are sick oh we've got a feisty one here you're not a troublemaker are you you were... if I were you I'd consider that a warning if you're not careful it'll be your last now what was it I could do for you do you know where a man called Sophistos lives Sophistos? He pleaded with me for a special permit for a research laboratory when the Great Chimney was built. Do you have the key for the old chimney? Of course I do. But no one in this district gets something from me without giving me something in return. What do you want me to do? As you may recall me saying, there's a golden rule in my district. Nobody messes with the ships. As long as they let the dockyards be, all those little rogues are fine by me. But lately, one of them hasn't been playing by the rules. A man they call Mercutio. And so, I am forced to react. Shall I take care of this Mercutio for you? If you can, let's say remove him, I'll give you... You'll find Mercutio at the Ambrosial Lotus, a very shady establishment. 
It's located just at the end of the stairs that lead down. Very well. Maybe I should get this key before I mess with uh, freaking uh, Ox. Sorry, we've got no jobs at the moment. The girls... Are you Mercutio? That's me. Why do you ask? You broke Largo's rules. Largo sent you? Hey, you don't need to do this. I I'm sure there's another way. It's too late to talk your way out. Draw your weapon. With pleasure. Consider this your answer for Largo. My turn. Get out of my house now. Get out of my house. Yeah, man, everybody's popping online, aren't they? Uh. Wow, and her fat ass is gonna get in my way. That's lovely. They will never break your rules again. You are valued indeed. Here, the key is all yours.
Yeah. It looks like it needs a key. It looks like it just opens up. Deeper down, huh? Interesting. Missing something. Sophistos? Hector was right. The rats didn't leave much evidence. Where are your manners? Sneaking into my laboratory like a thief instead of knocking on the door. In case you didn't notice, you're dead. Ah, that explains a lot. I need to talk to you about the Black Grimoire. Oh, the book of books, and at the same time, not a book at all. It was given to me, it's mine, and no one will ever see it. But not just because I'm being awkward. Lend me your ear, and I'll explain. Once upon a time, in a faraway land, a book was written, not with ink and not on paper. Who wrote it, nobody knows. But the knowledge within can change the cosmic rules in the hands of one who can look beyond the far horizon. Please, go on. No one knows why and no one knows when, but the Black Grimoire found its way into our world. It didn't take long for word of its powers to spread and everyone who heard of it wanted it. Please, go on. Rather than let the book's powers fall into the wrong hands, it was decided it should be destroyed. Hot fire is needed. Very, very hot fire. And I was the one who had to destroy it. So when this chimney was built to provide energy for the dockyards, I secretly stepped in and made some adjustments that would enable me to burn the book. Did you burn it? No, I didn't. I couldn't. I will never be able to. All I needed to do was activate the chimney and put the book onto the grating. But when I touched the book, oh, I was intoxicated by its power. I needed to protect it. I was not strong enough to burn it. Where is it now? I buried it. There's a villa on the southwestern isle. The book is buried in the garden, close to a tall tree. But why would you want to do that? You wouldn't want to do that, would you? Ask a gondolier to take you there and unearth the grimoire? No, you wouldn't. 
You could. You could put an end to all the horror, but I would never let you. Now, go. You know what okay. you have to do. Go and do this thing I do not want you to do. Why not? That was like a plan. Alrighty then. If there's any of those guys in this section. How can I help you? I want to travel. Where do you want yeah, to go? Yeah, this is a horse for me. Oh, that's how, okay. What the hell? Oh, okay. Oh, that's what's her name. What the hell is he? to see you. I guess you're here to receive your reward. I think you agreed on 3,000 ducats in the end, didn't you? Here, take it. Make yourself comfortable. Alright. Don't mind if I do. That was easy money, I guess. How can I help you? I want to try. Where do you want to?
don't know what I'm doing. The random places. It's so sort of digging everywhere. I wonder if that's what butterflies are for. Or these. I can figure out where this is at then, I guess. Wait, that was the right place, wasn't it? How can I help? Hey, you? why did you do that? Goodbye. How can I help you? I want to try. What? What if it is there? I'll try this one more time, and then I'll go. Take a quick break. I have no idea where that villa is. I'm gonna make this part.